Underage drinking is dangerous at any time, especially so during a pandemic. This week is all about raising awareness. Reporter Aaron Heft shows us how National Collegiate Alcohol Awareness Week is happening amid a complicated year. Carving out a path, many young adults navigate life outside their nuclear family and real life choices start piling in. One of those, whether to consume alcohol or not. Drink responsibly. But this year, it's even more complicated. You know, make sure you're practicing um, safe, uh, you know, pandemic safety to avoid, you know, COVID spread. Shirag Patel of Fast Med Urgent Care says there are a lot of things to keep in mind to stay safe, explaining that get togethers can spread COVID and over drinking at those gatherings can easily lead to alcohol poisoning, risky sexual behavior and even death. So alcohol poisoning is real, um, you know, we may have experienced alcohol poisoning ourselves in the past without realizing it. You can die. You can definitely die. Coupling that with our region's high rates of chlamydia, gonorrhea, and syphilis. Bell County just last year making a top 10 list of the highest rates of sexual transmitted infections and diseases across the state. Nearly 50% of newly diagnosed cases are uh, among kids and adults ages 15 to 24. Many people now avoiding the doctor's office out of fear of COVID. But Patel says getting tested is still very important. If you feel like you have been exposed or even if you just want to be sure, uh, get a test done. Uh, there are multiple ways to get a test done. Call FastMed. Go on FastMed.com. Uh, you will be able to find you know, information and literature where and uh, how to get a test done. Patel's message on the dangers of over drinking and the possible risky behavior that follows is not only important to remember during this National Collegiate Alcohol Awareness Week, but always. In Waco, Aaron Heft, 25 News. Aaron, thank you. According to Fast Med, adult men should only have two drinks a day and women should only have one. Each drink shouldn't exceed 12 ounces of beer, five ounces of wine, or 1.5 ounces of liquor. Also remember, buzzed driving is drunk driving. A BAC of just 0.08 can result in a DUI. Also important to remember are the symptoms of alcohol poisoning. They include feeling confused, dizzy, vomiting, low temperature, and seizures. If you see someone experiencing these symptoms, FastMed says you should call 911 immediately.